adding some fresh new gimbals, Hall Effect gimbals, to this old X90. I'm also going to be upgrading the speaker and replacing a broken switch. These are a pretty common break. First thing I'm going to do is <coughs> remove my lanyard that good old bot grinder gave me. And I am going to start actually with removing the eight screws on the front. There are 2.5 millimeter hex screws. And these are going to free the gimbals up on the inside. gimbals so they should easily pop out when I remove the back plate and also you're going to want to remove your battery which I have already done so for the back <clears throat> a simple Phillips head that can reach down in the holes which this is your deepest hole you only need about a, an inch long Phillips head driver. Just have to remove the six screws for the back plate. So all six back screws, backing plate screws are out. You just kind of pry the two cases apart. And you just have to remember these switches <clears throat> kind of stick in the cases and prevent them from sliding apart sometimes. As you can see, I've already even marked my switches <clears throat> because I wanted to know which side was A and B. So the B is the back side. All right, so now the gimbals should be technically loose. I'm going to <clears throat> unplug the main switches for the gimbals first, or the, the main plugs. plugs are out. I find these plugs extremely difficult to remove on the trim switches. So I am just replacing the entire trim switch. <clears throat> trim switch and a really easy way to tell the trim switches apart is the one on the bottom has a shorter wire loom than the one on the side so this one has to reach over here this one has to reach right here and look at that so I've already got my front four screws removed and that gimbal just pops right out That is going to be my right side gimbal. We have to remove the screws for this gimbal. All right, and this gimbal just pops out and slides out. And there's my throttle gimbal. Easy as that. All right, so time to just throw these 
Hall Effect gimbals in. And I have to wiggle and jiggle them to get them to go into their position sometimes. Remember the one, the trim switch with the shorter cable went to the middle here. switches are all in. I'm going to flip this over. And go to this side so I can actually put my screws in for my gimbals. I'm just going to start with one on each gimbal. are in place. Alright, so now we're going to come back here and change the switch out real quick. So you basically just unscrew this little nut here and then the, screw, the switch will pull out on the inside. And there's really no indication for which way this went so I am going to just put something in here and try to see yeah there's no real way to indicate so worst case I can go in and just invert this switch these are actually soldered on here it looks like 
you sure are. Alright, so I'm going to have to go in and solder these two wires to this. Alright, so real quick I'm just going to replace this speaker. It's a pretty easy process. Just pop this plug off. And then this guy, I just kind of pry this little plastic thing up. comes off and the speaker should just pry out. It just has that sticky foam thing there. This one just gets shoved on there. supposed to break these tabs off and seem to be in my way so I just push them over and pull them off so there's no going back now so this slides under the board goes right over these guys like that So I'm just going to knock out this switch replacement real quick. I'm just going to add some flux here to these two connections. And I'm just going to guess and say it's these two connections here. My soldering iron warmed up already. So let's just tin this guy real quick. there. Okay, this guy. Just gonna remove this guy. One and two. Just retin these. The middle first. This switch just means it's ring removed, it's not removed. It's right through like that. And then the nut goes back over top. switch has been repaired. I'll tighten it up once I get the radio case back together. All right, everything is done. I got the switch replaced. I got the speaker replaced. I've got my switch switches all aligned here. This is one of the biggest pain in the neck of getting this radio back together. You just flip the case over. Set it back down gently. One side's happy to go. There it goes. Some 
reason this guy's not lining up properly. There we go. All right, now I just have to put my back screws back on. Gimbal upgrade, switch replacement, and speaker upgrade.